Hey guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods and we are doing the October monthly reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Please keep in mind these are general readings. Energies can be flipped, times fluid. Everything said here might or might not resonate with you. So take what resonates and leave the rest for others to receive. Let's jump in. If you're watching my video for the first time, thank you. Welcome to my channel. And if you've been kind enough to come back, welcome back and thank you so much. Taurus, my bulls. Look, the bull came out for bulls. How cool is that? Your dreams need a practical plan, my bulls. An idea without a plan is just a desire. Expect powerful changes. Nice. I like that purple green going on. That's wealth and compassion going together. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Full moon in Capricorn. Wonderful. After winter comes spring, I'm told. Hmm. Let's see how this integrates with the tarot. I hope you are able to see all the messages. Yes, lovely. Let's jump into tarot now. For my bulls, October monthly, please. Oh, my balls. <sighs> the current situation. We have the chariot. The end of a tough cycle approaches. You're all set to move. What's crossing you is the four of pentacles holding on to some, some things. Magician as your grounding energy in your recent past is the strength. Wow. Guys. Whew. Crowning you is the six of cups. My God, bulls. Near future is the hierophant. We have got six cards out of which four are major arcanas. I mean... That's some strong flow of energy right there. You are in a very, very powerful. No wonder it says expect powerful change. The energy flows feels very powerful. Nine of Pentacles, you're working towards your independence. Towards your financial independence towards you being independent, self-reliance, the emperor in the external environment. Wow. Oh my God. Five of swords in the hopes and fears. Wow. That is just, what a flow. Ten of swords in the outcome. We've got the five of wands as the underlying bottom of the deck energy. Off the bat, the message that I get, you are ready to end a tough cycle. You are all set for it. Strength in the past shows that it was a difficult situation to be in professionally or personally, doesn't matter. And you have stood your ground. You have shown that inner strength that what it takes for the, it's not easy to make a bull shake. Uh, uh, you've shown that. What's grounding you is magician. You have been manifesting this change, this move. Six of cups in your crowning makes me feel that there is something that is making you feel nostalgic. You're looking back. You're ho as I said, you're holding on to some emotions, some uh, grudges probably someone's memories who knows 
in the near future we have the hierophant something with solid foundation coming in someone coming in life who's going to help you get to this nine of pentacles as we see he's not only just a mentor he's an emperor in your in your external environment we have the emperor that's someone who comes along with plan as it says your dream needs a practical plan and we have someone in your surrounding who is going to give you that help to get to your nine of pentacles to your independence you do fear conflict five of wands as being the underlying energy which is resistance someone might this is your fear someone might put barriers on your way someone might create issues for you 10 of swords as the outcome yeah it's it's wrap up time it's wrap up time you're going to drop the bags you have shown enough strength you do have that you are standing in that power chariot we have the four of wands wow so two messages came straight away as the four of wands popped out this could be separation in a marriage or a marriage like situation you are moving out this has been a tough cycle for you this has been a tough relationship to be in or this could be getting out of a job or a professional situation solid foundation something that has been in your life for quite a while a company that you have worked for let's say 20 years or something something that was long term basically whether it was a marriage whether it was a job something long term you're moving from there the issue here is that you are still holding on energetically to this four of pentacles as the crossing energy please clarify the four of pentacles four of pentacles oh jumped out the sun wow remembering remembering the happy times too much of nostalgia we have six of cups here not able to move on because you have so many memories so much that you gave and receive in this whole process whether personal or professional as i said spending a long time with a company itself it gave you friends it gave you it friends who became family or this could be about family too much of nostalgia holding on to memories good hap most mostly good and that's the reason it's difficult to move but you are the one who who manifested this move look magician as the grounding we have the strength again you knew heart in heart you knew knew it's time to move from here this was something tough you showed your toughness too in this tough situation and only that is the reason why you are in a position now to move you did not succumb to the pressure i mean come on even if we have consciously taken a decision to move out of a relationship or to leave a job it's only human to feel this way so it's all right don't be so tough on yourself my dear taurians two of pentacles in the reverse for strength yeah you had made up your mind there was no confusion whatsoever you were not doubting your decision you were like this is it that's what i need to do i need to move that's it five of cups with the six of cups yeah this is this is hashtag nostalgia overload that's what it is just looking back at the good times some bad times 
laughing over a glass of wine with your friends a few tears also shed because it's not gonna happen no more it's not gonna you guys are not gonna sit together after a shift and enjoy that evening together something like that the hierophant the queen of wands yeah someone is coming your way as i said someone who's gonna this is this is fire energy someone who's gonna light up the past someone who's gonna bring in that spark back again someone who's gonna guide you this hierophant and emperor energy really is going hand in hand nine of pentacles we have the four of pentacles and the tower yeah whatever you are listen four of pentacles again we have as the challenging energy four of pentacles again and the tower no matter how much you hold on to this well it was time and you know that that it was time there was no doubt in your head that it is time for this phase to end in life whether personal or professional i'm saying it again this is for your own independence whether you want to start a business on your own or whether it is time for you to move out of that relationship and be on your own and find your own path the emperor in the external environment please okay what's that we have the eight of cups yeah you're all set to move this is all this the the way the energy has flown so far this is all to do with leaving something behind it's taking me back to this end of a tough cycle approaches it's not done yet it's approaching you are in the process and you are flooded with emotions that's what's happening it's all coming back to you now you're looking forward to your future but you are spending too much of time looking back so you are not able to focus on what's coming in so that is the reason why in the external environment you have the eight of cups it's time to drop that so that you can start planning and that is what the emperor is going to help you achieve five of swords in hopes and fears please page of wands yeah you are afraid of rushing in something you are all in your head look how how tired and how spent this person looks like because you are so mentally consumed by everything that's going on the emotions are running high you are feeling extremely nostalgic and emotional but we got to come up with a plan if we want to go further the page of wands can definitely be someone who is coming along with a uh, new energy but this needs planning this is new idea coming your way right that's making you think and think and think the emperor is here to help you someone is there the hierophant too but the thing is these are all supportive energy at the end of the day you have to work for your independence for your 9 of pentacles so don't get laid back i'm told 10 of swords as the outcome finally dropping the baggage 8 of pentacles focusing on dropping the baggage wonderful what a journey what a journey for you bulls yes you have given yourself the time to think about it come to a point where you have made that decision of moving on it's in the process so it's a lot of churning going on emotions are running high you are feeling nostalgic you are feeling it's like a bitter sweet experience that's what the word i was waiting for bitter sweet yes temperance at the bottom with the five of wands the resistance is shown yes but seek guidance seek guidance from your angels 
find that inner peace go within so that you can eventually move forward in a much balanced manner look the hermit right underneath the uh, temperance yeah it's time to go within and find that light four of wands under the five of wands showing resistance to this we had four of wands somewhere right yeah in the current yeah this was something this is that has solid foundation so clearly it is difficult to let go you know it is time to let go it's just difficult to let go guidance message for my bulls please guidance message for my bulls wow okay let's see what we've got brahma you know in hindu mythology brahma is the creator let's see what the message is uh, i'm gonna read it from the book for you god of creation it is time to create brahma the creator of the universe and all beings has come to you with the message that now is the time to bring that idea to fruition what were we talking about your dreams need a practical plan you are getting divine guidance for this if not now then when if not you then who what is that idea you've been sitting on but haven't taken action now is the time to plant that seed into the earth and water it with your intention so it sprouts to life benefiting all those around you Brahma's rosary symbolizes the time cycle through which the world moves from creation to sustenance, from sustenance to dissolution, and from dissolution to new creation. Exactly. We are wrapping this old cycle up. We are in the process of wrapping and starting, which is kind of difficult, but that's what it is. And you do have the God of creation guiding you for that. We have temperance, as I said, the last card was temperance that came out. Seek divine guidance. And this is what it is all about. Your angels are sending you signs. Which cycle are you on? It's time to decide. What a powerful reading, my bulls. I thank you all for joining me today. It's a wrap. Namaste from the land of gods.